Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Floss, back again with another video. And today I'm gonna give y'all an update of my favorite new portable battery charger, the Use Bowl 2. Now you can pick this one up online, I'll throw the link up in the description, and if you wanna watch my original video, I'll leave a link for that right here. Okay, so a few weeks ago I told y'all I'm gonna start doing more update videos, especially if it's a product that I like, or if it's a product that I'm calling my favorite. And this is my favorite new portable battery charger. Now let me start off by answering a few questions that people left in the original video. Number one, is this airline friendly? That means, uh, can you travel with it? Is it safe to fly with? The answer is 100% yes. It's completely airline friendly. Now I flew out of four different airports, two in New York, one in Vegas, one in Florida. Every time I went through TSA, you know they tell you to take out your big electronics, I took out my tablet, my laptop, my Steam Deck, my portable battery charger, put it in the bin, push it through, go to the other side, picked it right up. No issues at all. So it's completely TSA friendly. Next question. Is this better than my favorite old portable battery charger, the Zero Lemon Tough Juice? Now, if you watch my channel, this has been my favorite for years. Let me say this. The Bowl 2 is pretty much better in every single way. Now, let me break it down for you. First of all, you could charge more devices. With the Bowl 2, you could charge six devices. With the Zero Lemon, five devices. Next, MagSafe compatibility. Now, this is just a casual video, okay? We're talking as friends. Let me tell you a quick story. When I go on vacation with my girl, here's what we like to do. When we're chilling out, she likes to play a lot of R&B music, and I like to play a lot of whole, you know, hardcore, old-school hip-hop music when we're getting turned up. So we like to take turns DJing. All right, so we can both, you know, I got, I got to compromise. We won't, she can play her music for an hour, I'll play my music for an hour. So she's playing her R&B music, the hour's up, I'm ready to turn up to some old school hip hop. I said, you know what, let me connect my Bluetooth uh, speaker to the phone. So she said, cool. So she disconnects her phone. I took my phone out. My phone was on about maybe 7%. I took my phone out, put it on this charger like this, because it does have a wireless charging pad. Put it on the charger like this. Now about 15 minutes, into my groove, I'm, I'm reciting Mob Deep songs word for word, all of a sudden you hear, Broop, Bluetooth speaker disconnected. I look over, I don't know if I was getting too hype, maybe I bumped the, the couch a little bit, and the, the phone moved a little bit. So now my phone was not even on the charger, it's completely dead. So I had to relinquish the DJ, <laughs> DJing skills back to my girl. With this, the Bolt, it's MagSafe compatible. What does that mean? When you drop your phone on it, it magnetized. So now, no matter what, it's not gonna move around. If I would've had this on the couch, I would've been good. Not to mention, a lot of people like to sleep with their phone in the bed. Now, me personally, I like to do that if I know I gotta catch a flight in the next morning and I really don't wanna I wake up late, I like to sleep with a battery charger in the bed with me and my phone right next to my head. With something like this, that have the MagSafe compatibility, now you can put this on your pillow, put it right next to your head, even when you're tossing and turning in the middle of the night, it's not gonna move around. So that is a huge upgrade, MagSafe compatibility. Next, more personal stories. This one actually charges your Apple Watch. Now I can't tell you how many times I went on vacation and forgot to bring my Apple Watch charger. Now, maybe two vacations ago, shout out to my girl because she saved me. She happened to be wearing an Apple Watch that day and she had her charger. But maybe three vacations before that, I forgot my Apple Watch charger. I like to pack at the last minute. And when I realized I didn't have the charger, I looked at my Apple Watch, I had about 50% battery left. So what I had to do was power off the watch because I need to fly with my Apple Watch on. I had to power off the watch and save it for my flight back home. This can charge up your Apple Watch. So now that's one less thing to worry about. You don't have to bring your Apple Watch charger. Next, OLED display. Check this out. Now this is huge, all right? An OLED display that gives you the exact battery percentage. Now when you got products like this that have four LEDs, if you got two or three LEDs, like this one right here has three LEDs, then that means you know you got over 50% battery, no issues. But what happens when you got one LED? You never know if you got 1% or 25%. So if you pick this up, you hit the button and you see one, one LED and you're like, okay, well, I, I know I got 25% battery and you really only got 1% battery, you're gonna be very disappointed. I like to know exactly how much battery I have. 
So this way, if I pick this up and I see it's on 1%, I know I got to charge it. Maybe if I'm going on a short trip and I see it's on 19%, that's good enough for me. So an OLED display that shows your exact battery percentage, that's clutch. And lastly, now this is the biggest difference between these two portable battery chargers, the charging speed. This one takes one hour and 15 minutes to charge from zero to 100%. That's three times faster than this, and that's even faster than your Galaxy S23 Ultra 5G. That means, okay, if you like me and you like to pack at the last minute, this is another true story. Anytime I go on vacation, I try to maximize my vacation. Okay, so if my flight is at 2 o'clock, I'm waking up at 11 o'clock to hit the airport. Okay, so I'm going to wake up at 11, start packing, and i got to be at the airport by 12. So I need a good hour. That means I could fully charge this up in the space of me packing and getting ready and rushing to go to the airport. With something like this, this one takes forever to charge. Forever. Versus one hour and 15 minutes. So to answer that question, do I like this better than the Zero Lemon Tough Juice? Yes, I like it better in every single way. Not to mention, it looks better. This one looks more modern and sleek. Next question, why? Why is this my favorite portable battery charger? I'm gonna give y'all 10 reasons. Number one, the build quality. Now this is made from aircraft grade anodized aluminum. Okay, it has that cold aluminum feel to it. Looks very futuristic, very space age, very high tech. I love it. Okay, so the build quality, A1. Number two, the design. MagSafe and Apple Watch on the top, which means you can also charge AirPods, basically anything that has Qi wireless charging, but the MagSafe, that's super important. The design of this is great. Power button, easy to reach, all of the ports on the top, you know, nicely labeled, and a big bright OLED display, okay? So the design, terrific. Next, number three. You can charge six devices at the same time. That means two phones, two laptops, two tablets, two Bluetooth speakers. Whatever you got in your tech bag when you travel, you'll be able to charge all of that at one time. Now, fellas, if you travel with your girl, ladies, you travel with your man, both of y'all can charge your phone at the same time. Both of y'all can charge your MacBooks, your tablets, your cameras, whatever you got, your projectors, six devices at the same time. Let's see, number four. Apple Watch charger. Now, I already went over that, but I love the fact that I don't have to worry about packing my Apple Watch charger whenever I travel. Number five, you got 290 watts of total power. So that means if you're charging up two phones, you can still charge a laptop, a tablet, a camera, and a speaker, all at the same time. Let's see, number seven, MagSafe. Okay, we already talked about that. I love having the MagSafe built into the charger. Number eight, this features pass-through charging. What does that mean? You could charge up the battery and charge devices at the same time. So that means you can use this as a hub. And that's exactly what I did on vacation. I plugged this into the wall, then I plugged in a couple of phones and tablets, had my Apple Watch and iPhone at the top. The whole vacation, I never unplugged it, okay? So now when I'm ready to go, unplug everything, my battery was at 100%. So now when I get on the flight and I'm ready to use my Steam Deck, I got unlimited power. So pass-through charging. Number nine, the OLED display. Again, I love being able to see exactly how much power you got and exactly the output for each uh, port. And number 10, okay? My favorite thing about this charger is the charging speeds. I can't stress that enough. Being able to charge this from zero to 100% in one hour and 15 minutes is incredible. Now, if you watch my original video, I did it down here live. It took me one hour and 17 minutes. So if a company says one hour and 15 minutes and you do it in one hour and 17 minutes, that means it's true. Plus or minus five is the margin of error that this charges faster <laughs> than your average cell phone. Okay, so the battery charging speed. That's 10 reasons why this is my favorite portable battery charger. Now, there's one more thing I wanted to address. One of the company's claims is that they can charge, this battery charger right here, will charge a MacBook from zero to 50% in 30 minutes. Now, I never tried that out, so let's do that together. All right, so I just plugged in a MacBook Pro. Let's zoom in. You can see the battery is at 
1%. Okay? Battery at 1%. Can y'all see that? Okay, so we're going to hit the timer. We hit start. The bold is at 100%. And now we wait. All right, so we just reached 30 minutes. I'm going to unplug the laptop. Let's open it up. And let's check the battery. 49%. Look at that. Can y'all see that? Let me zoom in on that. 49% in 30 minutes. Now, like I said, the company claims 50% in 30 minutes, plus or minus five is the margin of error. And once again, I'm calling this the truth, okay? 30 minutes, this is the MacBook Pro, 16 inch, from 1% to 49% in exactly 30 minutes. This is amazing. All right, so one last side note. Now, if you wanna pick this up, it's still available on Indiegogo. The price is 159 bucks. Now, when it comes out, it's gonna be way more. Here's one of the company's claims, charge your MacBook to 50% in 30 minutes. That's true. Charge up the actual battery in 75 minutes. That's true. Ladies and gentlemen, this is easily my new favorite portable battery charger. Now, let me give you some advice. If you're going to buy one of these, okay, or, uh, Asus ROG Ally or Steam Deck handheld gaming console, I'm not going to do an updated video on this because my opinion hasn't changed. I love it. But the battery, the battery is trash. Same thing with the Steam Deck. It's a little bit better, but it's still kind of trash. If you're going to buy one of these for your commute, I recommend investing in a portable battery charger. And if you're going to spend your money, you want to go with quality over quantity. Get something that's going to be worth that price. Look at the build quality. Look at the performance. It lives up to all of the hype that the company is claiming. This is a total win right here. Anyway, this is the used Bolt 2. Hit me up in the comments. Let me know what y'all think about this one. And let me know if there's any other products that y'all want to see an updated video on. We'll keep them short and sweet. Shout out to everybody rocking with me on Facebook, Foursquare, Twitter, Google+. Plus. Shout out to all the Google gangsters. I see y'all holding down that Facebook page. Shout out to everybody hitting me up on Boxer. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with me on Instagram. Y'all know that's where I'm at full time. 100% full throttle. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with the new stream on Sundays. Y'all already know. Stream Dunks is on deck. Get your drinks ready. No meat for a lap. Oh yeah. Special shout out to everybody following me on Snapchat. Flossy underscore Carter. That's where I'm at. And a special shout out to the notification squad. I see y'all in the comment section early. Hashtag salute. Oh yeah, one more thing. I almost forgot. Fellas, ladies, say it with me. All y'all haters, all y'all trolls, close your eyes and picture me. Look. It's your boy Floss of Mountain. Spock won the beam up. Energized. Hey guys, Jerry Springer here. Uh, subscribe to Flossie Carter for the real reviews. Uh, he has a tech channel on YouTube, and he already has over 2 million subscribers, so uh, give him a look. Uh, you may like it, and it could be very useful. Take care of yourself and each other.